and that is best for high gravity, high scoring is called ST stacking. Shocky is considered to be the best at ST stacking in the world, has a 25 oh, page Google that. Doc. In case that. you want to learn about ST stacking, linked in his Discord bio, 25 page document. Um, I got through the first three pages and I got confused and then I put it away and never looked at it again. Anyways, so Salted's board, a little yeah. questionable. Salted's board, that's that's definitely the case. Yeah. There's, I'm, I'm, I don't think there's any doubt about that. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, I think Salted's cooked here. I'm going to I'm gonna be honest. TC is a very forgiving game, though, if you do know how to press the zone button, which we all know Salted has a couple of issues with that. Calls it the win button. I'm just hoping, I, I, I haven't seen like a, I haven't commentated a Salted Red match in some time. I'm hoping we get an MK Wii in here. Oh boy. I, I saw him do it one time, and he did a little dance, and it was the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> yeah, Salted, very physical player. Does he have a, potentially, have a, I don't think he has a PC here. But Salted is playing very well. Keeping it incredibly clean here on the back-to-back -back train. If Salty can keep his board clean, then he can do very well in these matches, but it's the fact that he's just not used to the handling of this game. That and the zone usage. Yeah. But RJ, a very solid player in TC, a lot more comfortable with the handling and with the zone usage. Um, so he's the favored player in this matchup. He's won Ultima Cups. He's made a great placement set, MTS. And uh, PPT Zeno champion, RJ. No uh, no slash when it comes to this game either. Ooh, that Jameis drop from Salted. A very nice fix with the SP right there. Still going to find a decent zone. 43 out of 16, not too bad. Ooh, we're, we're dead even. Mm-hmm. Uh, at the start of this phase three, we see both players above 60,000 score, and that garbage is going to start coming in really messy on Salted's board. And again, the phase three meta is to just kind of stack on top of the garbage if you are in the position to do so, and just try to spam attack at your opponent because you know that that is going to come in as messy as possible. Yeah, it's definitely a balancing act, trying to keep your board low and go down without staying behind. Exactly. And, and that, uh, Salted, yeah. unable to do that there, dies in the process. Yeah, had a good up stack over the garbage, but the person with the lower garbage has more room to up stack and therefore has the advantage in that phase three situation. Both players opening with our uh, tried and true 6-3, the TEC way. You could tell Salt that the gears are turning right now for him doing 6-3. He is not, he's not, he's not a 6-3 guy. He's a salvo guy. <laughs> Yeah, opener's not very strong in TEC because of the zone. Most players want to uh, maximize zone charge early on rather than focusing on flashy openers and high attack at the start of the round. Since in phase one, you do just send your opponent clean no matter what, might as well try to speed run zone charge so you can send that uh, boosted attack as early as possible. And Salted. Oh, boy, howdy. Ooh, that is a bad it, series no, of misdrops. Yeah. I think Salt is cooked right here. Oh. Uh, oh, can you, you, you can spin that, can you? Okay. Oh, oh. Oh, and an all oh, 63, 63 ulti. ulti. Oh, Salted's dead. <laughs> oh, my God. Dude, top out quick, please. I want to see all your stats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Not the two OTs. <laughs> that was nasty work. Oh, that is brutal. Very close to one APP there from RJ. That's what we love to see. Yeah, that was that was incredible. And now we see the opener come out from RJ. What is that one? I can't keep track of how many openers there are and what they're all called. Yeah, salted okay. little uh I have no idea. This trap situ Oh Ooh. my god. Wait, is that it? Ooh, that's it. Oh my god. Oh, that's it. Oh my god, salted oh. sitting so far away from the <laughs> 
the way to go. Welcome to TEC. I mean, we've all done it. We've all made those no, unfortunate mistakes. I'm just shocked. I forgot it was first to three. I was like, man, the first round was solid, too. And first then, round was very solid. Um, and then, you know, little mistakes at the top of your board, that can ruin the whole round super quickly. I mean, TC can be a very forgiving game in the way that zone is used, but if you don't use that zone, if you're not screen watching your opponent's attacks, you don't know when that attack is coming in, you don't know to hit that zone, not forgiving anymore. Yeah, I mean, win button. Gotta hit the win button. The win button also doubles as the not lose button. That's, you know, that's the important part of the games. There's the offensive zone, there's the defensive zone. Taking the defensive zone, can